Prime Minister has spent weeks trying to reassure Canadians. Now he's warning the ones who aren't listening. We've all seen the pictures online of people who seem to think they're invincible. Well, you're not. Enough is enough. Go home and stay home. These pictures at a Vancouver beach are said to have made the Prime Minister particularly angry, as these normal signs of spring are a big sign of trouble. People ignoring public health advice. We need to slow and stop the spread of this virus if we are going to come through this uh, strongly as a country uh, without losing too many of our loved ones. Avoid crowded places. And to drive it all home, the first of a series of ads to push public health advice that is acutely important for people in acute settings. To protect the health workers at risk of being overrun. To keep the virus out of long-term care homes where Canada has seen the most deaths. Even to keep essential services like grocery stores running. Not knowing is no excuse. Listening is your duty and staying home is your way to serve. It's a message all governments especially want the snowbirds to hear as they fly home from the winter. It is essential that they don't stop for groceries, that they don't visit their friends or family on the way home, that they're not stopping anywhere but going directly home and doing so safely. Go directly home and stay in your house. You're putting thousands and thousands of people at risk. It's the toughest language to date with the threat of tougher enforcement measures if people still don't listen. To this point, Ottawa has left the hammer in the hands of the provinces, many of whom are happy to swing it. David Cochran, CBC News, Ottawa. Yeah, guys, stay the fuck home.